Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create and publish a post on your WordPress blog. I actually did a video on this back in 2013, but after almost seven years, it's probably time for an update. And this time, I'm gonna do it in a three-minute tip. So if you have a WordPress site, you should be able to go to your website and then slash admin, which will take you to the WordPress login page, and then you can log in. After logging in, you'll be taken to the WordPress dashboard. And then to work with posts, you're just gonna go to posts in the left-hand menu. I'm just gonna click on posts, which is gonna take me to all posts. There's one sample in here now, but if you have a bunch of posts, you'll see them listed here. But we're gonna click add new. And this is gonna open up a new post. I'm using this Divi theme, which is why you see this here but I'm gonna to switch to default editor and this is what most of you are gonna see. So I'm not gonna to get too much into the WordPress block editor, but you can add blocks using this button here to add to your content, like adding a paragraph uh, or adding images to your blog post. I just pasted in some sample text here for now, but what I'm gonna go over is some of these options on the right hand side. So if you click on document here, which is already selected, you can see some information on status and visibility. So we could change it from public to private, to password protected. Most people are just gonna set it as publish or as public. Uh, and then for publish, you can publish it immediately or you can set it to publish sometime in the future. You can change the post format, which might depend on your theme. We can stick it to the top of the blog. We can set it to pending review and change the author. The next thing is categories. So there's no categories set up on this site but you can add new categories to arrange your posts into different categories. You can add tags, which is another way to kind of index the different subjects of your blog. And then you can add a featured image. All you gotta do is click set featured image. You can upload an image or choose one from your library and then click select to add that as a featured image. And the way the featured image is displayed will depend on your theme, but it's usually just gonna be an image at the top of your post. The excerpt is just a small um, portion of your or intro to your blog post that's going to be used uh, throughout your theme, depending on the theme you're using. Discussion is some settings for allowing com comments to be on or off. And then down here, I have some uh, theme specific settings that are specific to the Divi theme that I'm using. So that's pretty much all you need to do to create a new blog post. Uh, you can click publish or you can save it as a draft. You can also click preview. I'm gonna go ahead and do that just to show you how it looks. Uh, this is pretty pretty uh, typical with a title on top. Uh, this meta information here with the category, number of comments, date, and the author. Here's how the featured image looks with this theme. And then my text and comments are on. The right hand side, there is a sidebar. And if you're looking to customize a sidebar, I'm not gonna get into that too much here, but you would go to appearance and then widgets. And right here is where you'd be able to customize your sidebar for your blog. So that's just a quick overview of adding a new post to your WordPress blog. There's a lot more detail I could get into, like again, adding blocks and formatting your post here, and then how your blog interacts with your website and how blog posts are displayed is going to depend on your site design and the theme you're using. So you can check out some of my other WordPress videos to get more in depth on some of those topics, and we'll see you on the next video.